In this video, we will see setting of cryo controller. So this is cryo controller. The temperature range of uh, this cryo controller is 2 to 8 degree. Now the controller is showing high. That means it is not in the range. So now the current temperature it shows is 30 degree. So we can see on the display. Model number of cryo controller is CC5210 which is also mentioned on the display. So there are four keys mentioned in the control panel. First is set button, second is enter or reset, third is up key and fourth is down key. While setting the controller setting, we can use this four key to set the parameter. All this controller setting is already set by factory. So we need not to press or we need not to set any key in field. But we can check or we can cross verify the parameters if we have any issue with the cooling. We will see how to check internal set parameter. To check internal set parameter, continuously press set button for 5 seconds. Once we press set button, it will show P50 that means password setting. We can increase that P50 50 number till 69 that is code of our setting. Once we select the 69, again press set button to go to the next menu. So first parameter is SLL that is set low point that is 2. Next is SHL that is set high alarm limit that is 8 next is next is al that setting should be hl next parameter is delay parameter dlt that should be 3 next parameter is alarm time that is alt which should be 5 next is defrost frequency that is indicated by DFR that should be 0. Next is defrost time that is DFT which is 0. Next is decimal point. There are two options yes or no. That decimal point setting should be yes. Next is relay set point that is R2 which should be no. And the last is factory set that is FST that should be no. So in this controller there are two sequences of setting. So we have checked one sequence by using password 69. Now we will check the second sequence of setting that is by using 39 password. Again we will press set button continuously for 5 seconds till it, it shows P50. So now we have to decrease the number to 39 to check the parameters. So this sequence will show the operating mode and time delay parameters. So first is operating mode parameter which should be COL. So there are two options cool or heat. COL is indicating cool mode. Next is hysteresis which shows by HYS. It should be 0.5. Next is time delay parameter. It should be 2. Moving ahead, uh, next parameter is offset parameter, which should be 0. Next is open parameter, which should be off, which is for cycle on or off. After checking all the parameter, press set button to save all the setting. If we are not pressing any key for 15 seconds, then controller will save the last change setting. Still, if you have any doubts, you can contact us.